Mr. Speaker, I rise today to commemorate the 192nd anniversary of Greek Independence Day. Greece and America are history's most storied democracies. Our founding fathers borrowed heavily from Greek antiquity to build American democracy. Our relationship with Greece, however, is more than one just of philosophical kinship. America, Greece, and Greek Americans have stood in solidarity since the founding of the United States. In this year, when we also celebrate the 150th anniversary of the Emancipation Proclamation, the 50th anniversary of the March on Washington, and the 100th anniversary of both Harriet Tubman's death and Rosa Parks's birth, it is especially fitting to recall how Hellenes and African Americans have reached out to one another to provide mutual support. When Hellenes acted to liberate themselves in 1821, James Williams, an African-American sailor from my hometown of Baltimore, joined the Greek Revolutionary Navy and fought at the Battle of Navarino. In turn, John Zachos and Photius Fisk, orphans of the Greek War of Independence, became passionate abolitionists in America. Zachos was a member of the Educational Commission of Boston and New York. Fisk, a U.S. Navy chaplain, helped slaves find freedom by supporting the Underground Railroad. In 1922, recently arrived Greek immigrants organized the American Hellenic Educational and Progressive Association in Georgia to defend themselves against the Ku Klux Klan. A HEPA went on to help countless Greek immigrants assimilate into American society and weighed in on many of the most significant social issues of our time, including the movement for civil rights. Archbishop Yakovos, leader of the Greek Orthodox Church of America, carried that commitment forward when he marched alongside Martin Luther King Jr. in Selma, Alabama in 1965. An iconic photograph of those two great leaders appeared on the cover of Life magazine. The historical relationship of these two proud communities embodies the greatness of America. On March 25th, when we celebrate Greek Independence Day, we salute all those who have struggled for freedom and rededicate ourselves to ensuring that America remains a symbol of fairness and opportunity the world over.